sense the urgency starting to creep in for both rooms here tonight. Game number four of this playoff series here on EA Sports. Opening face-off is just seconds away. Don't you just love playoff hockey? Listen to this place. Let's get after it. With the stop. Montreal's got possession of the puck. And it's a quick pass to Savard. Sends a pass over. Score! Just like that, the perfect road start. A cliche is always getting the start, but that is exactly what it means. And the coach couldn't have drawn it up any prettier to take the crowd into the game early and send a message right from puck drop. Well, this is just a fabulous shot, James. And the goaltender, he was flashing the leather. Everyone knows that he's got a quick glove. Wasn't quick enough this time. Montreal's probably confused. A lot of fans just sitting down right now as they look at the score and go, what, there's a goal already? I mean, some of the fans aren't even getting to their seats yet, James. I mean, there's a goal in this game, and that's how you silence the crowd. That's how you create your own energy. It's being ready to play right from puck drop. The Capitals have it against the wall. Washington's got the puck in the defensive end. The Canadians take possession here in the open ice. Quick pass to Savard. Puts it on net. Chance. He came so close to putting it in. James, I thought he had that one. If he continues to get to the net with that quick release shot, he's going to convert at some point in this game. Montreal's been rewarded early in this one by putting lots of pucks on net. Washington's won the draw. The Capitals move the puck in the defensive zone. Dishes it off. And that shot goes nowhere as the lane was filled. Montembeau's going to elect to just hang on for a whistle. Well, he hasn't been busy, James, and I like that he landed on this one. He's physically engaging, keeping himself in it. Lots of time left in this period. We got a 1-0 game to this point. The Capitals will go to work here in the offensive zone. They go on the attack through center. And he maintains possession of the puck here. Moves it quickly over to Ferrari. Montreal's got possession here in the neutral zone. Great use of the twig as he pokes that one away. Here's a short pass to Savard. Madison so effective in the O zone. I mean, he knows how to put the puck to the net. He got the go-ahead goal earlier, and now he's looking for more. Tosses it on to Doc. Gains the zone from the right. Fires it, and the goal to scores! Perfectly positioned to bury the rebound. Well, he does a great job of playing these angles perfectly, so when the rebound comes out with great timing, he's able to get a stick on the puck here, James. It's dirty, it's greasy, and it's a hard-nosed goal. see the frustration on the coach behind the bench here. His team didn't come ready to play and nothing he says or does makes a difference right now. Protus wins the draw at center. Washington's on the attack. Broken up by Barron. as the goalie hangs on. Montreal's holding a noticeable edge in the shot department here in the first, and they lead as a result. Washington's got the win off that draw, and he slides it quickly to Bear. Right through, center and into the offensive zone. Takes the shot. The Canadians take possession in the defensive end. And now he moves it quickly to Cooley. Crosses the puck loose. Dishes it to Wilson. Washington's across the blue line. Oh, what a save with the club by Montembeau. Nearing the midway mark of the period. Montreal's got a two-goal lead. They'd love to build on it. 
The Capitals win the draw. And he sacrifices his body to block the shot. And he'll opt to play the puck here. Benjapati's got the puck along the wing. Washington's got him along the wall. Slides it diagonally to Evans. Passes the puck over to Hardy Pinar. Takes a big hit. You want to send a message to your opponent early in the game, and that early delivery of a bone-crushing hit, that does just that. Loves the puck into the corner of the offensive zone. Takes a spill onto the ice and loses the puck. He grabs the puck here at the point. Shuts him down. Washington's got it in their own zone. With some open space at center. Stop up, stop up. And a stick break set up. Gallagher's stick handling in his own zone. Montreal's got the puck against the half wall. And here he is. Scores! Make it three in a row. are dominating in almost every facet of the game here in the first. Washington's won it. And he slides it quickly to Oshie. Oh, jumps right over the boards! Oh, yeah, and he's in the opponent's bench. This one's embarrassing, James. I mean, you're in your opponent's lap here, and you got to crawl your way out back to your side. Paints it over! Gives them nothing in front. Well, this save looks easier than it actually is. I mean, when you have a shooter right in the slot and you know that you've got to find a way to get your glove on it, you got to be fast, you got to be quick and show those reflexes, he does that and makes the save. The Habs have used their advantage in shots to take the lead here in the first. And they win the draw here in their own end. The Capitals take it across the blue line. Good stop by Montembeau. And we'll get the whistle after the goaltender hangs on. Past the midway mark in this period. Montreal's been showing relentless pressure lately, now up by three. The Capitals will start off on the attack after winning the draw. Loses his balance on the play. Here's a shot. Wilson's got it in the defensive end. Sends it in on the attack. The Canadians scoop it up along the boards. Takes a hit on the play. Caulfield's going to play it against the half wall. The Capitals have a hold of it in the defensive zone. Quick pass to Wilson. And that's broken up in the defensive zone by Barron. Skates to the crease. Moves with the puck at the corner. Lindgren's going to give everyone a chance to breathe and hang on to the puck. The Habs came hungry to play this one, and they lead as a result here in the first. And they take possession after the defensive zone faceoff. The Canadians have it in the offensive zone. And they'll get a breather as the goaltender covers it up. The Canadians have capitalized on their scoring opportunities and lead comfortably here late in the first. The Capitals get a hold of the puck in their own end. Gaining momentum along the wing. Shot! Left save made by Montembeau. Ref blows the whistle as the puck's covered up. The Habs have been rewarded with the lead here late in this first period with all the shots they put on net. Montreal's gonna start with the puck in their own end. Moves it over to Line. With possession along the wall. Backhander in front! And we get a whistle as the goaltender decides to hang on to this one. 
late goings of this period. The Canadians have dominated this one to this point. They lead it 3-0. The Frozen Biscuits drop, and we are back in the way here. The Capitals take it across the line. Works it across to Doc. The Canadians will play from the defensive zone. Working the puck deep inside their own end. Good dip along the wall by Dubois. Moves it to the middle. And he shuts down a great scoring chance there. Swatted away with the stick in the defensive zone. From the right side, they gain the zone. Sets it in front. And that's stopped. Scooped up along the wall by Oshie. The Capitals have it now. Here they come through center and into the offensive end. Handles the puck. And it's kicked away. Good read with the stick to break that out. Grabs control of it at the point. Penalty coming up here. The Canadians are going to serve two for tripping here. shot off that's leadership at its best special teams so important can they capitalize on this power play here with a face off now a quick pass to save way too much congestion blocks that washington's got a hold of it against the wall deep inside the defensive zone trying to clear the puck and that's put play by matheson battle along the wall the horn ending the first period both teams will have a chance to regroup you do you and we'll be back with period number two in a moment Cross the line and gain the zone. Moves it to the middle. And he denies that great opportunity there. Trying to get it down the ice. And that stays in after trying to play it off the glass. Yeah, and it's tough when you're on the PK, James, and everything around the sequence is good. And then all of a sudden you get the puck on your stick. That's exactly what you've worked for, and you fail to get it out. That can't happen. Time's up on the power play. Both teams back to even strength. Does a great job by the PK to have the ability to be aggressive and strong on the puck. Washington's ready to go on the attack. Exploring options here inside the defensive zone. And that's knocked away. Feeds the puck to Suzuki. And it's a quick pass to Caulfield. And he loses control of the puck. The Canadians have it behind the net. Moves it to Slavkovsky. On the attack along the boards. Taken along the wall by Slavkovsky. Coming to the slot. Fantastic save. Well, the shooter's in a coveted spot on the ice, right in the middle of it with a good look, and he makes an incredible save by getting square to the puck and turning it aside. Puck is frozen, and we'll get a face-off. Montreal's been all over them here in this second period. Just look at the score, and they have dominated in the shot clock, too. They win the draw and go on the attack. 
Montembeau has been able to watch the game for most of the night from the other end because of the offensive production in the offensive zone, James. But there's a real good job there. Timing is everything. Staying focused, tracking the puck, and making a good save at the right time. Streaking into the attacking zone to the right. And tries to make a diagonal pass to Protus. The Habs have the puck now. Off a stick and they can't connect. Intercepted at center by Line. The Canadians have been the better team tonight by far. I mean, this is... Scores! Break out the quad here on the skate because that's a full run answer. Well, it's incredible. You can tell that they are moving and shaking. They're getting the puck going north. They're transitioning so fast. And man, do they have their opponent on their heels. Well, he certainly looks frustrated after letting that goal in, James. It's almost like a fielder in baseball. If you touch it, you should be able to stop it. And he gets a big chunk of that one. Unfortunately, it goes in the netting. You can certainly see that the coach is boiling over right now. It's a sense of frustration and anger that his team hasn't put any effort into this game. Listen, it's not just about trailing, but it's about the way they've done it. Just no effort, lackluster performance, and no attention to detail. Montreal's dominated right from the start. Their offense clicking on all cylinders, and they lead here in the second. The Capitals take control of the faceoff. Offside the call, we'll get a reset. We haven't even hit the midway mark of the period. Montreal's now up by four. Evans takes possession after that center ice face-off. Big play inside the defensive zone. Washington's ready to go on the attack. The Capitals have the puck in the corner. Oh, he got all of that. What a save by Montembeau. He does a great job of having sound positional play based on where the puck is on that low inner spot. And he makes it. Scores! And the pylon continues. And these home fans, I think, have had about me. And the goalie covers up for the whistle. Ovechkin's the one to lead the comeback here. He's the captain of this team with an offensive zone faceoff. No better way to create some momentum than get one on the board. The Canadians win the draw on their own end. Picked up along the boards by Caulfield. The Canadians take it along the wall. The Capitals have it from their own end. Levels up into the wall. Power forwards drive the lanes and they drive bodies, and that one's perfectly executed. Matheson's carrying it ahead. And slides it across. Here's a chance. Scores! Oh, that was a beauty. Everything going their way, all the 
offense, all the goaltending, all the defense, and we're still only in the second. Dare I say they may get the day off tomorrow, James? Coach has to be so impressed with their performance so far. It's like they're playing a game of keep away out there. The Habs get a hold of the puck along the boards. Quick feed to Wilson. Here's a chance! Oh, to Nysom with the paddle save! That's a great save, but the goaltender had to get out to the top of his crease, take away all the ice and make himself as big as possible. Montreal's had the better scoring opportunities and lots of them, which is why they lead in a big way here in the second. The Canadians win the draw. Grabbed along the board by Doc. Here's the puck. Great use of the stick in the defensive end by Roy. There he is from the slot. Oh, and he gets a piece of that one to keep it out. Sorry, B. What shot. Puck picked up by Wilson. Through the neutral zone up along the wing. Checks off the coverage. Big time stop. Montreal's gained possession along the boards. The Habs will play it in their own end. Puts a little mustard on the hit to knock the puck loose. Sends the feed in front, and a new pass. Takes a shot, denies him in close. Oh, what a save there, James. I mean, that situational awareness at its finest, knowing exactly where the threat is in that slow slot and taking all the space away. Montreal's coaches were preaching lots of shots on net, and they have done it and lead as a result here in the second. Puck is dropped, and he wins the draw here in the defensive zone. That's some good footwork to take it away. And he coughs it up with the pass. Big save in front. Scores! It's in the back of the net. And it comes from an unlikely source because that's his first career playoff goal. Well, he's been relentless, James, in his playoffs. And you know what? He's found a way to find the back of the net. That's going to be a huge confidence boost for himself and his teammates.
here to come out and challenge those at the top of the paint, but he was quick anticipated to make the save. Montreal's looking to carry this sizable lead here into the second intermission. They have been the dominant club tonight. Well, there you go. Two periods down, one more to go, at least for now, right? Third period just around the corner. Welcome back, everyone. Both teams lined up at center ice, and we are ready to get this third period underway. The game is not over yet. Let's see if they can try to rally back here in the third, but they've got a long way to go. Well, two periods down. Here we go with the third period. Cheryl, your assessment so far. Washington's up against a hot goaltender, James, and you know when a goaltender's feeling it, you're going to have to get them moving laterally, and so they're going to have to find a way to go east-west and know exactly when to fire that puck. Moves the puck over to Suzuki. Textbook poke check by Ovechkin. He got all of that one. Carries it into the offensive end up the middle. Washington's got the puck against the boards. Oh, a nice play to free up the puck there. Quick pass across to Carlson. And there's a shot, but he bounced to the goaltender as he goes off the inside of the iron and stays out. Manjia Pani's had a tough time around the net tonight, James. It's hitting the bar. He's got to find a way to cash in low with his hands. At some point, if he gets the opportunity, he's going to put it in. And he loses both the puck and his balance after that hit. Washington's got control of it now from their own end. And he gives it over to Milano. Can't hang on to the biscuit after that. Quick pass to Barabari. Good defensive effort to poke it away. And a great save. A player should never be left alone in the slot, but man, is the goal's end of the task here. Gets out in front of it and makes the save. Dishes it off. To the front. Washington's got him in the wrong zone. Feeds it over. And that's a smart heads up play by Barron. The Canadians have been so strong all night long. They've been positionally sound. They've disrupted play and they've really created a ton of offense. But in particular, it's been their interceptions and their takeaways that have led to the offense. Blocked by the defender. Nice play. Moves it quickly over to Wilson. Control the puck after taking a little knock. From the point, looks to make something happen. Find some space in the corner. Montreal's got the puck behind the net. Here's a short pass to Barron. Evans has the puck against the half wall. Takes the pass in front. Oh, boy, did you hear that off the bar? We got a whistle. Penalty coming up. The Capitals are getting penalized for slashing. Fatigued. I mean, just look at the last shift. I mean, in their own zone, finding ways to get the puck out. And, of course, the opponent just owning play, hemming them in, and finding ways to get the puck to the net. So they've got to continue that pressure. And if you're on the goaltender side, you got to make sure you get it out of the zone and give them some rest. Moves it to Slavkovsky. And he takes the dish. Montreal's got the puck along the wall. Strong defensive effort. And they send it down the ice. Puck battle along the boards. Knocked away by Gallagher. Washington's going to be able to kill a few seconds off now with the puck. From the point, they take control of it. Oh, stick save and a puke. Trying to get it out of danger. And they get it out. Montreal's got it in their own zone. Up along the wing. Michael Dutton won game of inches and he puts it off the outside of the post. With a comfortable lead, 
James, some would say that that power play really wasn't a big deal, but I would say different. It's really important that you push, you continue to work on your habits because the timing could be different next time. Oh, what a hit against the boards! He executed perfectly, James. I mean, he can't maneuver. He's got nowhere to go. He's lined up, and then he's taken down. Dubois crossed the line and is on the attack now. Matheson's got it in the defensive end. Pokes away the center right. Here they are on the attack. Slittering feed. What a chance, but they can't connect. And he rings the post. The Canadians have a big lead here. They've been dominating possession. Everything's a very habits. Being aggressive, staying on the puck. But you know that they always want to put it in, and this one just wires off the frame. The Capitals gain possession. Quick feed to Benjapani. Along the half wall with the puck. Slides it across. Redirecting in front. Nice stick save by the goaltender. Got a piece of that one to swat it away with the twin. And that's knocked away by Matheson. Big time stop there. Stop He saved it. Oh, wow. Offside, we got a face off coming up. The Canadians have pummeled their opponents tonight. They have been the busier team offensively and have converted numerous times here in this third period. Washington's won the draw. Quick pass to Ovechkin. Poked away by Barron. Montreal's looking to break out of their own end. Sends the pass across the ice. Along the side, here they come to the neutral zone. On the attack into the offensive end, right up the gut. And a nice takeaway in the defensive end by Pesetta. Gallagher's got it in the offensive zone. And that was stopped. And now it's to Chikrin. Takes the feed. Shot, and it's turned aside by Montembeau. Here's a chance. Oh, he comes up with a stop. There's the whistle as the puck stopper likes to hang on. The bench has been letting the land with this point streak, playing so confident. He knows where he is on the ice, and it just seems that every time he makes his way towards the net, the puck's going in. And off the draw, they'll take possession. Strong use of the body. That's what gets it done. It's beyond the skill to be able to make a save. It is the will and the compete level that energizes everyone around him. Moves it quickly over to Slavkovsky. Washington's got possession of the puck. Caught. Turned aside with the glove by Montembeau. Puck is frozen, and we get a stoppage in play. The Canadians are looking to protect the lead here late in this third period as they have been the dominant offensive club. Montreal's got possession here in their own end. Puck scooped up by Ferrapari. And now he tries to get it across to Milano. They've got no one to blame for themselves. 
goes with this performance tonight. Sends it over to Sandine. And there's the final horn, bringing this one officially to an end. We talked about going into game four, about how critical it was for both teams, and now we've got ourselves a 3-1 series, and that's a huge advantage now, Cheryl. What a critical game, James. I mean, you've got a 2-1 lead, and your opponent is staring you down, trying to get the equalizer in the series. Instead, they're faced with a two-game deficit, so now you got to find a way to keep the pedal to the metal while they're down and close it out. Well, I certainly had a great time, and from all of us here at EA Sports, I'm James Sabolski. Thanks so much for spending your time with us here this evening, and we will see you at the next playoff game.